Lisa, good morning to you. As this investigation continues, at least one Springfield Township officer has been placed on a paid administrative leave. Now, that is standard protocol during these type of procedures. At this time, however, the officer's name nor the name of the deceased has been released. Chief Browder says it's important for his office to proceed with transparency. Now, the incident began with a 911 call to the 900 block of Twincrest right around 8 o'clock for what officers and police describe as a domestic disturbance. Officers arrived to two women outside of the residence and reports of a man inside of the home with a gun. Now, police say the man brandished the weapon and was shot by responding officers. A handgun was recovered on the scene. Now, calls to dispatch reported a total of about eight to nine shots being fired. And the initial 911 call was for a verbal altercation that was rapidly escalating as the man on the line said that he was throwing out a woman's clothes from the residence. Are you having verbal or physical trouble? It's all verbal. And we were yelling, and then her friend's yelling back at me, and I'm tossing her stuff out, and I'm done. It's been months, and it needs to end now. It's very early in the investigation. It'll be, you know, an extensive uh, investigation that, that will take, you know, a good, good period of time. Now, certainly very chilling hearing that man's voice on the 911 call, realizing that hours later he would be dead. At this time, Chief Browder says that transparency is paramount as this investigation continues. Now, Lisa, the last time we saw an officer-involved shooting incident goes back to 2016. That was when officers had to shoot a suspect who fired on a police canine unit here in Springfield Township. Reporting live this morning, Richard Childs, WLWT News 5.